Welcome to Sprinkles of Theology, brought to you from Christian Thought. This is Jerry Adams, the host of Christian Thought, and we are reading from the Shorter Catechism of Baptist Version. And today we are on question number 17. And our question is, did all mankind fall in Adam's first transgression? And the answer to our question, because the prohibition regarding the forbidden fruit was given to Adam as a representative of mankind, he disobeyed not only for himself, but for his posterity, so that all mankind descending from Adam by ordinary generation sinned in him and fell with him, in his first transgression. And for scriptural support for this answer, we have Genesis chapter 2, 16 and 17. And the Lord God commanded the man, saying, You may eat, surely eat of every tree of the garden, but of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil you shall not eat, for in the day that you eat of it you shall surely die. And we read in Romans chapter 5, verses 12, and then 18 and 19, Therefore, just as sin came into the world through one man, and death through sin, so death spread to all men, because all sinned. And then down in Romans 5, 18 and 19, Therefore, as one trespass led to condemnation for all men, so one act of righteousness leads to justification and life for all men. For as by the one man's disobedience the many were made sinners, so by the one man's obedience the many will be made righteous. And over in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, 21 and 22, For as by a man came death, by a man has come also the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all died, so also in Christ shall all be made alive. And that is a sprinkle of theology. If you like these sprinkles of theology, please subscribe, like, and share to help out this channel. And thank you for listening, and God bless.